Hello, fellow SOLD members. Um, my name is Victoria. My husband, Christopher, and I run We Started With a Mouse on eBay and Etsy. Um, Roger has asked me to do a quick little video on how to run through the rules and how to list on SOLDs and how to share to your social media from SOLD. So let's get started. Um, the rule is if you list one up to five, you can do one to five. For every one you list, you have to share one of someone else's, which, you know, that's really easy. So this is how you list. At the top of the page right here, it says, what are you selling? Click on that. It opens up. And today I've decided to list this, which is uh, something in our eBay store. And the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to copy the title. And look at the price. The price is $14.98 in the store, but Facebook won't let you use decimal points. So we're going to just round that up to 15. And I'm going to paste my title again. And I'm going to use that for my hashtags. And you don't have to hashtag your entire entire title. You just need to uh, do what's pertinent. For instance, I'm not going to say that there's a, a tan painted or that it has a tray. They can see that in the picture. Okay, and the last hashtag you want to put in is the solds hashtag. And we're going to pop that down a couple lines. And you're going to want to put your picture in before you put your the link to your store in because it wants to open up a preview from the store and it's just visually it looks better if you just go ahead and add your own photo. So define my picture. Um, most people put more than one picture in. I choose not to. That's entirely up to you. You can put every picture you have for that item in, or you can do as I do and just go ahead and put the one in or two in, however many you want. Okay, now I'm going to come back to my listing and I'm going to copy my description and paste that in and pop that down a couple lines and go back and copy the link at the top of your listing and go back and paste that in and we're going to go back and check we have our title we have our price we have the store link we have the description and we have the hashtags and we have the pictures so we're going to go ahead and post that There you go. Now when I go to share, that was my that was my fifth one for the day. And I almost did it without doing the video. So let me refresh the page and go back to the beginning. I'm going to go to my items. Oh, no, I'm not. I'm going to share other people's items. I've already done that actually for today, but I will show you how I do one. So if you go to, when you go to the page and you scroll down from the top, you can see recent group photos. You can click see all. This one I haven't shared yet. So what I do personally is I just open them up. Try that again. I hit the control key and click on it and it opens it up in a new tab. I go through and I do, you know, if I list five things, I'll go and I'll just check, click five things and they'll open up in separate tabs. That way I don't lose count. You don't have to do that, but that's what I do. So here you go. Here's a, a listing of Rogers. So what I'm going to do to share, I'm going to click on the link and open it up. Now I use promote pictures for my um, Twitter. If you don't have it, you can just go ahead and use the Twitter button. So I don't want you to be confused. Here's the Twitter button, the Pinterest button, the Facebook button. So I will, I use promote pictures. So I'm going to click on promote pictures. There you go. And I'm going to. 
Uh, I'm going to make sure I have it look, look the way I want it. I'm kind of a pain. Some people just go ahead and let it open up and choose all the pictures. I kind of like, personally, I just, because it's going on my Twitter feed, I want it to look the best it can look. And I'm, I'm going to hit tweet now, but if you use the, um, the Twitter button on site, I'll show you how that looks. And this is why, oh, I'd have to log in. I just tweeted it twice. There's no picture. And, and that's why I use, um, that's why I use promote pictures. It, it's a, it's a paid thing, but for me, it's worth it. So now I'm going to share it to Pinterest and I just go ahead and use the Pinterest button. And I don't have a, a category for scuba gear. So I'm going to go to one of my boards. I'm just going to share to a board and see it now. And make sure it's there and it is. Okay. Then I come back to the listing. I like it. And I let them know that I've shared it. And I have a little badge that I use. And that's done. And it's that simple. You know, um, if we've missed anything, just, you know, tell Roger that we've missed something or there's something you want to know. And we will make sure that we, we figure it out. Have a great day.